Question number three. A closed cylinder tank has a height of h meters and radius of r meters. So we got a cylinder. The radius is r and the height is h. Okay. Then they said that the tank can be fully filled with, so this is the volume, volume of water in the, so in other words, it's the volume of the cylinder. Lah. Find the total surface area of the tank in terms of pi and r square. Okay, let's do that. Question A. We want to find the total surface area, so we, we have to use the circle here, pi r square, and since we have two circles, it will be 2 pi r square, and then we have to find the curved surface. So you notice that there is no h here, it's only in terms of pi and r. So we have to find a way to substitute the h out so that there is no more h. So probably that's why we have to use the volume, that's why the volume is given. So volume equals to uh, cylinder is pi r square h. Okay, so the volume is 1, 2, 5 over 4 pi equals pi r square h. So we're going to make h the subject so that we can substitute. So pi you can cut. So h is equals to 1, 2, 5 over 4 r square. Okay, so this is the h. So we're going to find the area now. So the area is going to be uh, so we got pi r square, so you got top and bottom circle, so it's 2 pi r square plus the surface. So the surface, the curved surface here, when you open up, it's going to be a rectangle, right? So this will be the h, and this length here is the circumference of the circle, so it's going to be 2 pi r. So to find the area, is going to be 2 pi r times h. Okay, 2 pi r h. So now the h we're going to substitute with this because otherwise we won't be able to we it's not the final answer because they want it to be in terms of pi and r now we got h there so it's going to be 2 pi r square plus 2 pi r h is 1 2 5 over 4 r square so we can simplify this you still get 2 pi r square plus simplify this you get 2 r you can cancel one of it so you get 1 2 5 pi over 2r yeah so that is this is your answer this one is uh what's the unit uh? meters meter square okay so this is the answer okay question b the tank is made of a material that costs 720 per square meter calculate the minimum cost so when you see the word minimum cost that means you know you have to use dy dx. So question B. You want to find the minimum cost. We know that the cost is 720 per square meter. So that means we need to know what is the minimum area okay, that we need. Then using that area, you're going to multiply the price per square meter okay, to find the total cost. Lah. So first step is you want to find the area. So the area has to be minimum area. So we're going to use back the question A answer. So A equals to 2 pi r square plus 1, 2, 5 pi over 2. So I'm going to bring the r up here. r negative 1. Okay. So we want to find D A D R. Okay. When you want to find minimum, minimum point or, uh, yeah, we want to find minimum point, the D A D R is going to be equals to 0. Okay. We're going to differentiate. So you get 4 pi r plus, oh wait, no, not plus, minus, because you're going to times in front, right? So negative 1, 2, 5 pi, and then the r here becomes r negative 2, because you're going to minus 1. So r negative 2, so it's going to come down here, 2 r square, okay? Equals to 0. Okay, now we want to simplify this. What we can do is take the whole equation here times r square so that we can remove this r square so now what we have is 4 pi r cube minus uh, 1 2 5 pi over 2 equals 0 so rearrange this 4 pi r cube equals 1 2 5 pi over 2 
so we can try to simplify this so pi and pi you can cancel and r cube equals I think I'm just gonna write here right this side r cube equals to 1 2 5 over so the 4 I bring over becomes divide so it's gonna be 4 times 2 is 8 so when you find r you're gonna cube root this whole thing you get 5 over 2 so r is 5 over 2 okay so that means for it to be either minimum or maximum area the r is 5 over 2 now before we conclude this we have we also want to know uh we want to confirm if it's minimum or maximum so we have to differentiate this one more time okay differentiate one more time so you get d square a dr square okay so it's going to be 4 pi um this r is going to be up up here so it's r negative 2 so what happens is negative negative become positive so 1 2 5 pi 1 2 5 pi over r cube okay differentiate huh? i hope you all know okay? i'm just doing a bit faster here so we want to find the value of r so we just uh, substitute this to see what's the d square d square a d r square okay so it becomes 4 pi plus 1 2 5 pi over 5 over 2 cube so what you will get is the 8 pi 12 12 pi so 12 pi is more than 0 therefore this is a minimum area okay okay that's how we prove a uh, minimum area because it's more than 0 okay so now that we have confirmed that it's more than 0 and it's minimum so now we can find the area so the area is going to be area is going to be we're just going to substitute r equals 5 over 2 into the area equation so i will get 2 pi 5 over 2 square plus 1 2 5 pi over 2 5 over 2 okay so what i will get is um let's see what can i do here 25 pi wait 25 over 2 pi sorry and then plus 5 25 pi okay so i'm not gonna wait do i have to calculate this wait huh 25 12 point i know what i'm just gonna leave it like this huh? and then i'm gonna find the total cost because that's what the question is asking so the minimum cost is going to be the area which is this times the cost or per square meter so it's 720 so i can just straight away do this so when i do this i will get my cost which is rm 84,823 so this is the minimum cost